สาธุสาธุสาธุนโมทัสเซบะเกวตุวะเรหะตุสัมมาสัมบุญดัสเซนโมทัสเซบะเกวตุวะเรหะตุสัมมาสัมบุญดัสเซนโมทัสเซบะเกวตุวะเรหะตุสัมมาสัมบุญดัสเซ Homage to the Blessed One, the Worthy One, the Supremely Enlightened One. Three refuge, the Sarana. Bundham Saranam Gachami, Dhammam Saranam Gachami, Sangham Saranam Gachami. I go to the Buddha for refuge. I go to the Dhamma for refuge. I go to the Sangha for refuge. d u t i a m t i b u n d h a m s a r e n a m g a c h a m i d u t i a m t i d h a m m a n g s a r e n a m g a c h a m i d u t i a m t i s a n g h a m s a r e n a m g a c h a m i A second time, I go to the Buddha for refuge. A second time, I go to the Dhamma for refuge. A second time, I go to the Sangha for refuge. t a t i a m t i b u n d h a m s a r e n a m g a c h a m i t a t i a m t i d h a m m a n g s a r e n a m g a c h a m i t a t i a m t i s a n g h a m s a r e n a m g a c h a m i A third time, I go to the Buddha for refuge. A third time, I go to the Dhamma for refuge. A third time, I go to the Sangha for refuge. Five precepts, Panchasila. <coughs> Panati Pata. เวรมณีสิกขาปดังสมาดิยามิ I undertake the training to abstain from taking life. อาดินนาดานาเวรมณีสิกขาปดังสมาดิยามิ I undertake the training to abstain from stealing. ขามิสุมิจฉาชาราเวรมณีสิกขาปดังสมาดิยามิ I undertake the training to abstain from sexual misconduct. มุสาวาดาเวรมณีสิกขาปดังสมาดิยามิ I undertake the training to abstain from false speech. Sura meheraya majja pama dattana vera mani sikha padang samadhyami. I undertake the training to abstain from intoxicating drinks and drugs caused in heedlessness. Buddha Vandana, homage to the Buddha. Iti piso bhagava areham samma sambundho vinjacharana sampanno sugato lokavidu anuttaro purisadam sarati สัตตาเดวมนุษย์สานัมบุญโดบะเกวาทีดัมมะบันดาน homage to the Buddha's teachings สวากกาโตบะเกวะธาดัมมุสันดินทิโคอาคาลิโคเอหิปัสสิโคโอปนัยโคปัจฉันตังเวดิตัมโบวิญญู
Sangavandana, homage to the Buddha's noble disciples. Supati Panno Bhagavato Savaka Sango Ujo Pati Panno Bhagavato Savaka Sango Nyaya Pati Panno Bhagavato Savaka Sango Sami Chi Pati Panno Bhagavato Savaka Sangho Yadidan Chantari Purisa Yugani Atta Purisa Pungala Esa Bhagavato Savaka Sangho Ahuneyo Pahuneyo Dakkhineyo anjali karaniyo Anuntaram punyakhentam lokan sati Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu <coughs> Dear friends in the Dhamma, today our Tuesday Dhamma class First of all, we are going to practice meditation as you know, meditation means mental culture, purifying one's mind. According to Buddha's message, Buddha has explained three things that we have to do. Sabha Papa Sakaranam, not to do any evil. Kusala Supasampada, practicing good deeds. Sakitta Paryodapanam, purifying one's mind. Etam Buddha Hanasasanam. This is the message of the Buddha. Among them, the main advice that Buddha has given us is purifying one's mind. We should rec recognize there are three unwholesome roots that disturb our peace of mind. They are greed, anger, and delusion. By practicing meditation, we try to overcome these negative thoughts from our mind. Again and again, when we practice meditation, there is no space to anger, greed, or delusion. All Buddhist doctrines can be included into one thing, one advice, that is mindfulness. Mindfulness means awareness of our body and mind. Not only we are aware of our mind and body, at the same time we generate positive thoughts such as generosity, loving kindness, wisdom. Those positive thoughts at the same time we practice. And uh, day by day, when we purify our mind, then negative thoughts, evil thoughts don't come to our mind then we can develop our real happiness. That is why we practice these kind of meditation techniques. Especially, according to Buddhism, mindfulness can be divided into two. One of them is living in the present moment. Awareness of our mind and body. Not only we live in the present moment, but we reflect on impermanence. We reflect on what happens to our body and mind. We reflect on impermanence. Impermanence means at every moment our mind and body arise and immediately it cease. Nothing come to the present from the past, nothing will go to future from the present. The thought that arises at the moment arises in this moment and without remaining anything, it ceases. But previous thought influences present thought, and present thought influences next thought. But present thought, at the same way, didn't come to the present, and present thought doesn't go to future. If we can realize this truth, 
we always try to keep our attention in the present moment it doesn't mean that we should forget our past or future we can remember anything which happened in the past we can arrange anything which will happen in the future it doesn't matter but we do everything with awareness mindfulness then we know very well everything is created by our mind <coughs> then our mind is not fixed in outside persons and things as soon as we experience something through our senses we look at inside other people when they experience something through their senses they look at outside but we also look at outside we recognize something outside but immediately we look at inside when we see something when we taste something when we hear something when we smell something when we touch something <coughs> when we think something we are aware of that what happens to my mind then gradually greed anger and delusion the main unwholesome roots gradually decrease in our mind that is the final goal of practicing any kind of activities in the name of buddhism especially practicing meditation we try to achieve this goal and for that buddha has explained 40 meditation techniques meditation means mental culture purifying our mind and buddhist meditation techniques can be divided into two first there are main categories two main categories they are samatha meditation and vipassana meditation samatha meditation means by uh, contemplating on some uh, positive thoughts all some thoughts we generate positive thoughts in our mind we live in the present moment we develop our concentration tranquility by practicing samatha meditation there are four meditation techniques in samatha category the other one is vipassana meditation vipassana meditation is reflecting on the reality in the world what is the reality in the world there are three characteristics anicca dukkha and anatta anicca means impermanence dukkha means unsatisfactoriness anatta means egolessness or no soul first of all we purify our mind from negative thoughts when mind is concentrated we reflect on this reality impermanence whatever we think at the moment that thought arises and immediately it ceases if we can increase the duration of practicing impermanence reflecting on impermanence that is the real success in our life it means we don't depend on outside we completely depend on our wisdom then we can overcome sickness old age death and rebirth these are the challenges in our life other challenges we can overcome these are the biggest challenges in our life aging death and rebirth especially aging and death and if we can purify our mind and also if we can reflect on impermanence day by day we go on the path of liberation deliverance purification enlightenment and if we can increase the duration of practicing this path this is the real path of happiness liberation here we usually practice loving kindness meditation and sometimes we practice the contemplating on buddha's qualities sometimes we practice breathing meditation here we are going to practice very simple meditation technique in buddhism 
keep in our mind in the present moment, we contemplate on loving kindness. May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. Again and again we think this loving kindness thoughts. As the result of practicing loving kindness, we can overcome anger. Anger is one of the reasons that disturbs our peace of mind. As the result of practicing loving kindness, as soon as we look at a person, as soon as we hear a person, as soon as we remember a person, I think that person is our only son or daughter. If we have this highest attitude, actually we have overcome a lot of problems, struggles in our life. When we go on the way, if we can think the other person who is next to us, like our child, then we have no problems. We are always ready to give them to come to our line. It doesn't mean that we do slow, but we are going fast. While we are going fast, we always think other people are like our children. Sometimes they don't think like that. It doesn't matter. It's not a problem for us. But by practicing meditation or practicing Buddhism, we have a safety in our side. We don't correct other people at this first time. First of all, we should try to make a refuge in our mind. Then we can help others. Then we can face their problems too. But the first thing is keeping a refuge, having a security purifying our mind. That is the purpose of meditation techniques in Buddhism. And also, by practicing loving-kindness meditation, we develop our concentration. We train our mind to live in a particular wholesome object for a long time. This is the one of the places that we can see our success, our skillfulness. Even though we are very rich, and educated. Sometimes we are unable to keep our attention at least uh, uh, one minute. <coughs> if we can train our mind to live in a particular wholesome object for a long time, that is the real success in our life. It means at the moment we have no suffering. And also nobody or not, nothing can disturb our peace of mind. We depend on our insight. We depend on our wisdom. We depend on our own safety and liberation. Those are the results of practicing meditation. And here we are going to practice loving kindness meditation. First of all, we wish our life, our success, then little by little, we spread loving kindness to all over the world who are around us. Okay? Please get ready to practice loving kindness meditation. Please uh, sit relaxedly and uh, relax your body, please, first. <coughs> relax your body. Relax your body, please. Keep your right hand on the left hand. Close your eyes gently. I am sitting in a very pleasant, calm environment. Everything is prepared for my inner peace. I pay my gratitude to the people, those who have arranged these facilities to my inner peace. I am aware of my body posture that I am sitting here. 
from legs to head. My legs, knees, hands, shoulders, neck and head. I am fully aware of my body posture from legs to head. I keep my full attention in the present moment. I don't think my past or future. I am completely aware of the present moment. Now I feel only breathing in and out. I keep my attention around the nose or upper lip. Keeping my attention around the nose, I practice loving kindness to everyone. First, I wish my success, my happiness, then I spread loving kindness to others who are in the world. May I be well, happy and peaceful. 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 May all beings at this temple be well, happy and peaceful.
may all beings at this temple be well happy and peaceful may all beings at this temple be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this city pasadena be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this city pasadena be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this city pasadena be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this county los angeles be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this county los angeles be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this county los angeles be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this state california be well happy and peaceful may all beings in this state california be well happy and peaceful
May all beings in this state, California, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this country, the U.S., be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this country, the U.S., be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this country, the U.S., be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this continent, America, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this continent, America, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this continent, America, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this planet, the earth, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this planet, the earth, be well, happy and peaceful.
May all beings in this planet, the earth, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this solar system be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in the solar system be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this galaxy, the Milky Way, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this galaxy, the Milky Way, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this galaxy, the Milky Way, be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this universe be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this universe be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this universe be well, 
happy and peaceful. May all beings in this entire world be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings in this entire world be well, happy, peaceful and mindful. May all beings in this entire world be well, happy, peaceful and mindful. May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. I see all over the world like my family, like my children. My mind is filled with loving kindness and compassion. May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. Whoever I see, I meet, I think them like my sons and daughters. May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. Sambe Santa Bhavantu Sukitanta May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. Sambe Santa Bhavantu Sukitanta May all beings be well, happy and peaceful. Sambe Santa Bhavantu Sukhe Tanta May 
may all beings be well, happy and peaceful. Every moment my mind changed, my body also changed. Everything is impermanent. My body changes, my mind also changes. I have nothing to get as permanent. Everything is impermanent. My entire life is the present thought. That present thought arises at the moment that immediately ceases. I reflect on this impermanence. My mind is impermanent. My mind is impermanent. My mind is impermanent. Every moment, with the conditions, my mind arises. When conditions cease, my mind, the present thought, immediately ceases. My entire life is arising and ceasing of a present thought. I have nothing except this reality. I completely pay my attention to this reality, impermanence, arising and ceasing of my present thought. Mind is impermanent. Mind is impermanent. Mind is impermanent. My mind is impermanent, mind is impermanent, mind is impermanent. Every moment my mind, the present thought, arises and ceases. When I see this reality, I don't depend on outside persons or things. I completely depend on my understanding of this impermanence, which is wisdom.
day by day. I try to increase the duration of practicing loving kindness and reflecting on impermanence. This is my real success in my spiritual life. I always try to develop loving kindness, thinking may all beings be well, happy and peaceful. On the other side, I reflect on impermanence as my present thought is impermanent. Day by day, I go forward on this spiritual path. I dedicate my everything to go on this path. I give the priority to practice this path in my life. Day by day, I purify my mind from anger, greed and delusion. Day by day, I develop positive thoughts generosity, loving-kindness, and mindfulness. This is the real success in my life. Day by day, I overcome suffering. Day by day, I reach the highest bliss of Nibbana, Enlightenment, liberation. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu. Dukham panta chenidukham. Bayam panta chenidbayam. So kam panta chenisoka untu samde pipanino.